Recently at Phase 4, we've been receiving a great deal of interest about a wireless sensor network system used for monitoring refrigerators and freezers in commercial food operations and restaurants. The reason why the system has been so popular is people are actually quite amazed at how simple and easy it is to use and how effective it is providing 24-hour, every 10-minute, continuous monitoring of freezers and refrigerators to assure food safety. Now, one of the, let me explain real quickly how the system works. This is a wireless temperature sensor. It has a probe that will be routed into the inside of the freezer or refrigerator. Every 10 minutes, the sensor will wirelessly transmit over the air the temperature and the ID number and the name of the refrigerator that's being monitored. That data for the temperature travels over the air to this gateway that is installed in your facility. It can be connected to an ethernet cable at your, with your local area network, or we have this version, which is a cellular modem based, which requires no connection to your network. This gateway will then pass all of your sensor data to sensormanager.com on the internet, and you can connect to sensormanager.com using any web connected device, a tablet, a PC, a smartphone, Android, Apple, Windows, it doesn't matter. At any point in time from anywhere, you can see what's going on with all your refrigerators and freezers. The other thing that we're hearing from our restaurant and commercial food operators is they can't believe how fast and easy the system is to install. And let me explain how easy it is. The wireless sensor temperature sensor is attached to the outside of the refrigerator with a simple piece of Velcro. The tether is run through the gasket of the door to the inside of the refrigerator. We supply special stickers that um, work at cold temperatures that allow you to route the cable into the refrigerator or freezer and keep it out of the way. Once you've done that, which takes about a minute, you turn the switch on and you're up and running. ...to being super easy to use and getting text and email alerts when there's a problem. The other thing our customers are telling us is they love how flexible the system is. Once you have done your first installation with one gateway, this one gateway that will monitor all your sensors 24 seven can handle up to a hundred sensors. So once you install a few refrigerators and you see that you like it, you can add more and more refrigeration and more, more and more refrigeration sensors and more and more monitors. On top of that, the WSN system does much more than just temperature. We have other sensors that are very popular for uh, commercial kitchens and um, restaurants. This is a flood sensor that might alert you of a flood condition in a kitchen in the middle of the night uh, or in a basement. Uh, we have a door open, door close sensor. A lot of our clients find out that they see temperature spikes in their refrigerators and freezers and want to know why. And quite often they'll follow up with a door open, door close sensor to see if the problem is a door being left open. Uh, another type of sensor that we have is an activity timer. If there's some piece of equipment that you want to monitor for how long it's running. One of the best features of sensormanager.com and the WSN system is it creates an audit record uh, of your temperatures in everywhere a temperature sensor is um, uh, installed. And even more important than that, when there is a problem with a high temperature, sensormanager.com can send you an email or a text alert notifying you immediately of the problem. So let me sit down and I'll show you how powerful sensormanager.com is in a restaurant or commercial food kitchen environment. I'm going to first, um, I have the uh, overview screen open on sensormanager.com and I'm just going to focus on this uh, re first refrigerator temperature here. I'm going to open it up and you can see all of the data and the times uh, for this refrigerator. 
Now one of the really neat things you can do is uh, you can chart the data and you can see right here we had a problem where we had some high temperatures. Um, and if we go back to our history data, one of the neat functions that it has is when you have a condition like that, sensormanager.com allows you to go in and add a note where that happened and indicate what the investigation found and why there was a temperature uh, deviation at that point. Now, you certainly don't want to um, discover problems with um, exceeding temperature limits after uh, the event happens. You want to know immediately. So sensormanager.com allows you to set different temperature notifications um, and that if there is a temperature spike, you'll get a text or email alert, or even a telephone call if you choose, that will notify you that there's a problem within a few minutes of the spike. All those things can be set up using this notification tab, where you can set uh, email, text, or uh, for an additional price, telephone alerts, and you'll get a text or email anytime there's an alert condition. Let me demonstrate how powerful the online alert system is. SensorManager.com can send both text and email alerts directly to your smartphone, your PC, your tablet, whatever, so that 24 hours a day you'll be alerted if there's a problem. The way the system works is when a temperature alert happens, you'll get both a text and an email just like this. This is a text alert that just came in, and at the same time, I've also received an email alert indicating me of the same problem. For an additional fee, we actually also offer a telephone notification. And if you want a different type of notification, we also offer this output alert module that can be placed in an office or maybe the guard's desk with uh, bright red LEDs and a buzzer that indicates that you have a temperature problem that needs to be addressed. One of the really powerful features about the alert system is you get notification in real time. If there's a temperature spike in a refrigerator, you'll know it within minutes. And even if you're not at the restaurant or at your workplace, you can pull up your web browser, log into sensormanager.com, and see exactly what's going on. That's a little bit easier to see on this tablet, but you can see in this particular case there's clearly a temperature spike problem occurring with that refrigerator. Now, I have been notified within just a few minutes of that temperature spike happening, which allows me to address it quickly before I lose thousands of dollars of food in that refrigerator. The other thing our clients are telling us about the WSN system that they really like in a commercial kitchen is it's so flexible. Once this one gateway is installed, it can handle up to 100 sensors. And we see customers expanding the temperature sensors to many more different refrigerators and freezers than they first try. In addition, we have high temperature sensors that can be used in things like smoking operations or monitoring ovens. And we have over 30 other different types of sensors too that include things like this door open, door close sensor, which is very popular again for monitoring refrigerators and freezers. What we find quite often is that clients see temperature spikes and don't know why. And this sensor can answer whether, whether it's a problem with the door open or being, uh, door, op door being open longer than it should be. In addition, we have other sensors like this flood sensor that can indicate a flood in the kitchen or the basement when somebody's there or not there and send you an immediate text or email alert. Uh, and we have other sensors like this vibration runtime sensor that a lot of our clients um, find very helpful. Now, the other thing I want to mention about the flexibility of the system is that the, there will be an administrator for sensormanager.com that has full rights to the system. But you can give other people login rights with different um, uh, rights to see and do different things, such as you may have some people that can just view the data and other people that can set the alarms and, and change sensor names. I would encourage you to take a look 
uh, click on the button on this web page that will lead you to a more detailed description about how the WSN system works. We have a video demonstration of the system uh, in, in more detail, and we have instructions on how you can log into a demonstration system on sensormanager.com. You can go in, play with the sensors, and actually see how the system would work before you purchase one. Thanks for watching our video.